tree. I'd now like to give the floor to Gwendo Marcelina from Curaçao. I'd just like to urge brevity, please, because we do have uh, just not very much time available. Thank you. Yes, yes, go ahead, please, sir. Thank you very much. The protocol has been served already. And I want to thank you, all of you guys in Glasgow, and to remember, it's never too late to make the right thing, to make the things right. So there is no country also that is too small to make a difference. And for us, coming from Curacao as a small island, it is very important for us to be part in this major step of this parliamentary observatory. This helps us in also being more aware and conscious what is happening around us within the world and to reduce the vulnerability and also enhance the resilience of our communities and our countries um, coming especially from the Dutch Caribbean. It is very important so we can adverse the impacts of climate change as also part of the pioneers of um, environmental legislation. So it is very important for us to be part of this team and to be as a pioneer, a real example, and we really hope that all the hazards and the natural hazards that are within the world, we can uni uniformly within the, the parliaments of the Latin American communities, um, countries, but also the Caribbean countries, for us to be right there and part of you and be aware within the world how we can tackle and create more sustainability for everybody. So I thank you. Um, as you guys already said, protocol has been served and I have the two minutes. I just thank you for everything. Bye-bye. Obrigado, Gwendo. Thank you very much indeed to you. Thank you very much for being here with us from Curacao. I'd like now to call on the Minister from Turks and Caicos, please.